Hey guys, so I got a new toy. Well, it's not a new toy, it's an old toy. I'll put it back together again. I got a Watts Clever unit. Um, basically, I've hooked it into here. So now I can see how much my house is using. So that's solar. So that's over here as well. So 2.6. So this will change to 2.6 in a second. This one's a little bit slower. 2.52. Close enough. Uh, one thing that these, 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 these clamp-on meters don't take into account is uh, power factor. So it's just a rough guess. Uh, the house, is, our house and sheds using 2.9 kilowatts at the moment. And oh, there we go. We're we're drawing 113 watts off the um, off the grid. So we're coming on the afternoon, and we're drawing 600 watts from the batteries at the moment. Because remembering the house is run off the batteries and my shed and the big air conditioner, which is running in the house at the moment, is not. So that's pretty cool. I'm going to like this one. It's going to be good get to watch it and the batteries still have 105 amp hours to go which is quite a lot really <laughs> and what did we take at last death of discharge 275 amp hours last night so it's a bit of a cloudy day and we've been running air conditioners so we've been taking the batteries down a bit and that one there looks like we have got uh, so we had 10,000 amp hours but when I changed the computer so we've done 25,000 amp hours and again that doesn't really mean exactly amount but it's close enough so we've done about 25,000 amp hours from the batteries so that's pretty cool I think that's like 1400 kilowatt hours or something depending on which fancy way you work it out uh, there you go little update oh drawing 1.2 kilowatts from the battery 1.3 kilowatts from the bat from the from the grid the cloud come over so the solar dropped 